to the breaking news, which is good news for kids and parents and teachers. Pfizer says their vaccine is 100% effective in children 12 to 15. Now, this was a phase three trial. They just wrapped up the data out this morning showing us exactly that. And this means, of course, that teens could very well be fully vaccinated when everybody heads back to school in the fall. And that includes middle school kids. And that would be such a relief for teachers mm -hmm. and parents and kids. Crown Force Will Tran, one of those parents who this applies to in Contra Costa County this morning, covering the story. Hi, Will. Good morning, James and Daria. Great news for parents who are a little reluctant to send their children back to the schools. That's why they still have hybrid learning. But come fall time, if the kids are vaccinated, perhaps all the kids will be back inside the classrooms. And that's a big relief to the kids, the parents, and the teachers because of what you talked about. With Pfizer, yes, they have not done a huge sample. Only a few thousand people were tested. But they did say when the second dose was completed that those kids, 12 to 15 years old, that they actually created more antibody than older people and this goes along to what the cdc has been saying for quite some time that the kids the young kids not only are they more durable it looks like they produce healthier um, immune system than the rest of us especially even to the next age group 16 to 25 years old so far it has not been looked at by the peer review of course the health community will have to look at it to also give their thumbs up or thumbs down and of course in the united states it will be up to the fda to make the final call and pfizer has asked the fda to go ahead and look at this so hopefully approval will come sooner than later no major side effects after the second dose, James and Daria, they said, of course, you had a sore arm. In some cases, you have a fever and fatigue, but nothing out of the ordinary. And of course, things could happen down the road. And that's why they said those kids who did get the shots that they will be monitored for the next two years just to see what's going on. But it looks like it is a good armor for COVID-19. And that's great news for the teachers. I mean, we did the story yesterday in Oakland that a lot of teachers are not coming back, even if they are vaccinated out of fear that the kids are not vaccinated that might not be an issue come fall back to you fantastic news thank you very much will